okay interpret the coefficient so these are our coefficient so we have to find out the coefficient interpretation let's interpret it okay where is it okay interpret it so this is our question number two two and the previous was formally to the table was number one okay i'm using row one so that was one and this is two uh, second part of question I just ask for the interpretation and I have to construct 25% confidence interval. Okay, the travel time is, uh, the coefficient of travel time is this. And we have to show the relation with travel cost, okay. So you are seeing the travel time coefficient is uh, something and travel cost is this. Okay. So interpretation. Let's interpret. The coefficient. Interpretation of the coefficient. Okay. The first coefficient is travel time. Right. I mean, yeah, travel time. One. Okay, I and one. Travel time. If we see and zero point one three seven three nine seven seven means so we are seeing. I'm extremely sorry for the small resolution of my camera. So travel time coefficient 1.373 or something like this. It is mean, it's mean that mean that if if the travel time Travel time is increased by one hour. Hope you are seeing if the travel time increased by one hour, the travel cost travel cost we're seeing the trouble cost will increase by 0 0.137399 sorry 977 Well, increased by uh, at the dollar this much dollar okay just make a dollar sign over here because uh, in our question uh, the travel cost is measured as dollar okay let's check the second one which is income which is income so we have to show the relation with income and travel cost so the second one let's interpret it okay income coefficient is okay income coefficient is this one 
So if our income increased by one unit, the travel cost increased by this much. Okay, so let's take it, read it. If income increased by one unit, or it is saying $1,000. Okay. Uh, if our increase uh, increase by one thousand dollar, hope so, or one unit. Okay, guess not. Okay. So income coefficient. Efficient income coefficient. Uh, 0 0.18 uh, check out the check out your question uh, 886302 means means if income increased by thousand dollar if income in so increased by thousand dollar then the travel cost then the travel cost increase by zero point one eight eight six three zero two dollars. This is the interpretation of our income. Okay, let's check the third one. And the third one is terms time. Terms time is a positive relationship with travel cost. So, uh, oh sorry, terms on and terminal waiting time. So, okay, so uh, if terminal waiting time is for the third one, it is saying that if the terminal waiting time, I can just write it here. If the terminal waiting time time increase. Okay, in series -E increase by uh, one hour, increase by one hour, the travel cost will chance by. Uh, zero point eight five three one two four six so these are the interpretation of uh, this uh, coefficients so so if there is a positive relationship it will increase by this much amount but if there is a negative relationship like this that the LF is as in life expectancy in air has a negative relationship with population growth so the coefficient is negative so it means that if population growth increases the life expectancy actually decreases by this much amount or if the population growth growth decreased by one year or I mean one percent that's in the life expectancy will increased by this much amount so this is the uh, value multiplier i believe so if in this there's a negative or negative relationship uh, the result will be negative so this is the interpretation of the coefficients